let me look in the box. No, okay, okay. I'm gonna show you what's in the box, but just, if you promise not to flip out. Why would I flip out? What, is it a spider? You, oh, it's a spider. No, if it was a spider, Lenny would have flipped out. To flip out, to become extremely angry, or to lose control of yourself, to become emotionally unstable. Examples. I'm having dinner with my dad tomorrow night. Do you want to come? Sure. Yeah, he's kind of sexy. Oh, no, I'll, no, I'll be there, too. Okay, so we'll just come up with some kind of signal. If it's going well, you can take off. No, Phoebe, I just need you there for support. I haven't told him that I'm pregnant yet. Oh, why not? Because I know he's gonna flip out, and I hate it when he gets angry. If it makes you feel any better, when I was dating Penny, she used to flip out on me all the time. Whoa, you dated Penny? <laughs> she didn't tell you? She told me she dated a guy named Leonard. Who would've thought it was you? <laughs> Who else would it be? I don't know, somebody bigger and... Yeah, sure, why not you? We could put our stereo back there. And control it out. Run an infrared repeater, photocell here, emitter here, easy peasy. Hey guys, I got this. Yeah, hang on, Penny. How about fans here and here? Guys, it's hot in here. I think I'll just take off all my clothes. <laughs> oh, I've got it. To take off. This very common phrasal verb has five basic meanings. To remove something, especially a piece of clothing. To leave the surface and begin flight. To leave a place suddenly. To have a particular amount of time away from work. To become successful or popular very fast. Examples. Well, they're Joey's. They gotta be Joey's. <laughs> Why are they here? I don't know, uh... I'm Joey. Yeah, I'm disgusting. I take my underwear off in other people's homes. Well, get him out of here. What's wrong with you? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, excuse me, could I get... Guess not. Time to take your seats. We're about to take off. Buckle up, please, everyone. Chandler? No. Nope. Chandler! Janice, there you are. There you are. I had to have one last kiss, and, and also, also, you said you were gonna leave right after I got on the plane. No, no, I, I wanna see you take off. Well, then I guess I'm going to Yemen. Thank you so much for this. It was really so thoughtful of you. What, you're leaving? Yes, we have something we have to get to. Uh, oh, no. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take off too, actually. Oh, you guys, you can't leave yet. You have to stay. We, we've got the whole big thing planned. I'm so sorry I ruined your night. I'm sorry I almost made you sleep with Ross. <laughs> well, I'm gonna take off. Congratulations, man. Thanks. Hey, guess what? My sister Katie is coming to visit next weekend. She gets in on Thursday. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take off work Friday. We're gonna take her to the Empire State Building. Really? You do that? Of course, everyone should see the Empire State Building. My second year on the force, I was working a drug case, tracking this drug dealer for months. Then suddenly he disappeared right before Memorial Day, which I was supposed to take off for a guy's weekend with some friends. But how? We didn't know each other yet. Oh, other friends. So that when we do fail, it'll be that much more spectacular. If we don't get D'Angelo, my career is over. But. If we do catch him, your career will really take off. Chopper pun! By the way, man, this place is beautiful. Sort of gravel company. I mean, who knew it'd take off? Gravel company? Yeah. What about you? What are you doing? Not gravel. <laughs> I don't ask her out. I invite her to our party next Friday. We're having a party next Friday? We are now. Casual. All right, so call her up. No, Colin's not casual. I just gotta bump into her somewhere. If only I knew her schedule, I could arrange a chance encounter. That's great, Ted. You'll be the most casual stalker ever. <laughs> to bump into. To meet someone you know when you have not planned to meet them. Examples. Hey, uh, Rach, funny story. I bumped into Joanna on the street yesterday. My boss, Joanna? Wow, that must have been awkward. Well, no, actually, she uh, asked me if I wanted to get a drink. <laughs> you, uh... Didn't say yes to that, did you? 
<laughs> no. No. Hello, Rachel. So, you and Ruchi. Yeah, I'm sorry. I know you liked it too, but we just bumped into each other last night and hit it off. No, that's fine. You're my friend and I'm happy for you. Oh, thank you, Stuart. Plus, I don't know how you're gonna screw it up, but I know you will. Who's the father? You don't know him. It's not important. He wants nothing to do with me or the baby. Well, who is this guy, huh? Who is he? Because I will track him down and kick his ass. David Lynn. David Lynn! David Lynn! <laughs> David Lynn! To track down. To find someone, something, or find information about them after a difficult or long search. Examples. Okay, don't be weird. Don't be weird. Don't be weird. Hello. Hey, you found my drone. Yeah, yeah, yes. It took a while to track you down, but to see the look on your face, it was worth it. Aw, sweet. Rajesh. Cynthia. Ah, pleasure to meet you. Likewise. Now, I'm no doctor, but it seems to me that we all have an obligation to the public health to track down anyone who gives us a disease, inform them of it, and take overwhelming revenge on that person. Again, I'm no doctor. I'm just a normal guy who enjoys revenge. She gives the worst massages ever. Okay, it was like she was torturing me for information. And I wanted to give it up. I just, I didn't know what it was. Look, Chandler, if it really hurts that bad, you should just tell her. Look, for the first time in my life, I'm in a real relationship, okay? I'm not gonna screw that up by, you know, telling the truth. To screw up to fail at something, or to make a serious mistake. To spoil something, especially a situation. Examples. You whipping so slow, can't you do it any faster? Joey, come on, I don't want to make any mistakes, all right? This is the only dessert, and if I screw it up, everybody's gonna be like, oh, remember that Thanksgiving when Rachel screwed up the trifle? NASA asked me to throw out the first pitch at an Angels game. You got any advice? Yeah, don't do it. <laughs> Why shouldn't I do it? There's no upside. If you do well, no one cares. And if you screw up, you're an idiot on YouTube forever. <laughs> but it's for a good cause. What about all the kids that'll be there? That's what I'm telling you. Kids are the worst. <laughs> Promise not to flip out. Why would I flip out? Guys, it's hot in here. I think I'll just take off all my clothes. Who is he? Because I will track him down and kick his ass. I just got to bump into her somewhere. Well, I'm going to take off.